Hello, Cosmic Explorers! Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the mysteries of the universe and beyond. Today we're honored to share incredible insights from the renowned Andromedan contactee Alex Collier. But before we get started, if you're passionate about expanding your cosmic consciousness and discovering the universe's secrets, hit that subscribe button, click the bell icon, and give this video a thumbs up. This helps us reach more truth seekers like you. Also, remember that we host a live webinar every Friday at 2 p.m. Eastern Time, so be sure to visit the link in the description for more information. But for now, here's today's video. Do you think the deep state has still got its assets? How do they finance their bribery? What is your take on that? Well, you see, I think they have some assets, not a lot, but they have some. The bribery <clears throat> was usually with the fiat currency uh, or blackmail, or they are blackmailing people, <coughs> or families are being threatened. I mean, you know, let, let's face it, we're, we're, you know, we're not dealing here with, with beings that are on the up and up. We're not. They will do anything to maintain control or power. <clears throat> and it doesn't matter who they are, they'll use whatever resources they have, whatever leverage they have, in order to have and get their way. Now, they are, they are being hunted. They are in survival. So they will do and play any card they have to. They'll use anyone. They'll sacrifice anyone in order for them to survive. I mean, let's be clear. The agenda was planet Earth, 500 million people. That's it. There was no plan to send us to colonies in space. The plan was to exterminate seven and a half billion people. <clears throat> That's That was the plan. They stated it. They voted on it. They promoted it. And they went and did took steps to create the scenarios to make this happen. Sadly, it was our own government that was participating in this event. The Black Hats in the Department of Defense and others. Let's not forget that. This is not some imaginary evil. <clears throat> okay, we paid the salaries of some of these people. It's ugly. It's really, really ugly. They'll do anything. They'll do anything. I realize as humans, we have many powers, some of them latent. What protocols should we practice to be able to heal ourselves and our planet? Well, <clears throat> boy, that's such a little question. It's so easy to answer. Rot. <laughs> um, for me to actually know that answer, Jennifer, would mean that I myself would have gone through all those protocols and would be a fully and complete human being as well. And this simply isn't the case. You know, I'm still healing. I'm still trying to figure out how I got here to Earth, actually. I still have questions about that. <clears throat> you know, and I've asked to see my contract. So, uh, I don't know. I think any healing has to begin 
with one simple premise. And this I know to be true. Love thyself. You have to start there. Do you know if there is any more information on the archangels that are headed our way from another universe? I don't have any update on that. I, I was hoping <clears throat> some another contactee would have information on that. I know we're all waiting to hear a specific musical frequency or harmonic. Last time I heard ninth was telling eighth and seventh that they were hit the, they were hearing the frequency, which means they're coming. Everybody is given a heads up. That's the last thing I heard was that those on ninth were telling those on eighth and seventh that they were hearing the frequency. They were hearing the song. <clears throat> I don't know what's happened to 12, 11, and now nine. I don't know. It could be that the change is so remarkable, they themselves aren't quite sure how to express it or to explain it. I've heard that's happened before uh, in a different way. So we'll find out together, guys. We will find out together. Okay. Um. Yeah, Elena's tomorrow. Uh, Michael Sala's last webinar was just excellent. He really takes the very tough, tough topics and does a really, really good job with it. And I'm very proud of him for that. I'm also very proud of Elena. She takes a lot of heat. She's catching crap from everywhere and she stands strong and she presents with such grace <clears throat> you know, another remarkable woman. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey through the cosmos. We hope Alex Collier's insights have inspired you to look beyond the ordinary and embrace the extraordinary. If you found this video enlightening, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and click the bell icon so you never miss an update. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. We do read all the comments. Your feedback helps us create better content and brings us closer as a community of truth seekers. Together we can make a difference. Let's spread the light, expand our consciousness, and continue exploring the wonders of the universe. Until next time, stay curious and keep looking up. If you would like to see the Andromedan contactee Alex Collier live via video stream, we hold a live online seminar every Friday at 2 p.m. Eastern Time. For more information on upcoming live webinars, please visit alexcollier.org.